Welcome to the course on data management with ArcGIS and this video we are going to talk about the projection the selection how to perform the selection and do the special join in ArcGIS so the first thing we go to ArcGIS and then we can add the data by using these tools and you can also connect to the folder that you store your data your RGS data however there is a third way to add the data to AppMaps is to, to open your folder where you store the data and then you can click the SAP and then you can drop it to your AppMaps and then the data will show up on the left hand side as the layer and it's preview to you data with and how do I know the projection of these data so to identify the projections I have to click properties and then go to source and then I can see that this data use the projection NAD 1983 state plan Montana 2015 feet after I add this data then I can add the my data on the McDonald's, the second data, and I click add. And here it asks me to to transform the projection because the projection that I open of the MT and the projection of this McDonald's is different. So how I do it just go to transformation and then click add. And then I would like to import the projection the same to empty and I click add and I click OK and I click OK and I click close and then the data of the McDonald's in USA pop up on, on my RGS so the next thing I am going to do is I am making a query select by select by location I mean that I want to find uh, the the McDonald's shop in MTs. So I have to go to selection, select by location, and then I click on MTs target layer MTs source McDonald's, and I apply. This show that uh where does the the McDonald's stay at and where the location you see the district or the county of where the McDonald's stay at but for this video I want to select the location of McDonald's so I have to click on the McDonald's and I can empty and apply and then I I have to deselect first go to deselect and I apply again and the new selection of here is location of McDonald's in the state empty state then I can export my point by clicking right click it data and export data and I can go to export GS data I want to store it in GS public health data management and store it as McDonald. And then I click sell sell or save fast and then I click sell. It asks me that do I want to export the data to our map view? Yes, okay. And then I turn off the original McDonald's and it shows that it shows only the location of McDonald's in the states. So let's go to the attribute of the McDonald's. We have 47 McDonald's in empty states. So now I want to join the attributes of 
uh, of MTs to the McDonald's. You see the activity should McDonald's everyone to join more information about the state the, about the, the track. So uh, the tools that I'm going to use we call it spatial joints. You can click on window and search and type spatial joints. And then you click on the spatial join here tools. And then you go to the McDonald's clips and then go to the MTs. And this you can uh, uh, put your location or your data. It depends on where you want to put. And you can points. And then here I select the McDonald's clip. And then here I select the MTs. And for the max option, I because the point is in within the boundaries, then I will use the method as the within. And then I can OK. And it will be generating the spatial joint for my new McDonald's points. So the new McDonald's spatial joint has the attributes of the tracks that we can use for further analysis of our points. Thank you, this is the end of the tutorials.